In the mid-19th century, London was at the heart of the Industrial Revolution. It was a city teeming with innovation, industry, and people. However, fueled by overcrowding, poverty, and poor sanitation, diseases were widespread. There were large outbreaks of cholera that led to the deaths of thousands of people. Enter Jon Snow, not the King of the North, but a young physician trained as an anesthetist. Although we now know that cholera is caused by a bacterium, at the time, the existing idea was that it was caused by bad air from rotting material, the miasma theory. Snow went against the prevailing beliefs of the time and proposed that cholera was spread by contaminated water. In 1854, Snow started investigating a large cholera outbreak in the Soho district of London, where he worked. He got a list of people who had died from cholera and analyzed where they lived. He found that they lived around a pump on Broad Street that people used for drinking water. Interestingly, he also noticed two areas in the neighborhood where people hardly got sick. He found that they were using alternate sources of drinking water. From these observations, Snow concluded that contaminated water from the Broad Street pump was what was making people sick. Although his ideas were treated with skepticism, Snow convinced authorities to remove the handle of the pump so it could not be used. The outbreak ended shortly after. Investigations later revealed that the pump was drawing water from an area contaminated by fecal material from a nearby cesspit that was used to collect sewage. Snow continued to use data to show how cholera was transmitted. His pioneering work laid the foundation for modern epidemiology, the study of how and why diseases occur in different groups of people. His cholera map is a classic example of demonstrating the value of mapping in understanding and controlling the spread of diseases. With significant advancements in modern geographic information systems, mapping continues to be a powerful epidemiological tool. And that's the story of Jon Snow and his battle with cholera.